let's just uh, give people the details of what is Beacon, what is Beacon Air offering. Two grand a month, all you can fly, and you can think of it like Netflix. We get that comparison a lot. Um, you get four boarding passes at any given moment, and they roll the way four DVDs at your house did at Netflix. Right, so you can fly as often as you want, but you can sort of box out four seats at once. And where can you go? New York, we fly out of Westchester Airport, Boston Logan, and then seasonally we go to uh, Nantucket and the Hamptons. And what kind of equipment are you using? We use a variety of aircraft, Beach 1900s, King Airs, etc. Uh, turbo props, we're flying, we call them mission specific aircraft. So our, our destinations are about an hour away, and we fly those aircraft that'll be most efficient on those routes. And let's start with the King Air, for example. Maximum number of passengers there is what, eight? So we like Six. to set below 10 passengers. Okay. At 10 passengers, you get a new set of regulations from TSA Correct. to other things. So our passengers, we're trying to mirror as closely as possible the private flying experience. So they're going to drive out to the airport, they'll go to the private FBO, be greeted by a concierge, walk onto the plane, and off they go. And what about the on-plane experience? Because a lot of people are looking for things like uh, electronic hookups and internet. So these are business aircraft, right? Exceedingly comfortable, very, very different to what you're used to when you're flying commercial or you're on a shuttle between New York and Boston. What you find, though, is that the experience flying in a private plane is, is an intimate experience. It's uh, what we sometimes call a pass-me-a-coke environment. But you sit in club seating, so four of the people are facing each other, which is very different than when you get on the shuttle and you put in headphones to say, don't talk to me, to the guy next to you. Here, it, it spurs conversation, and you end up talking and spending that time actually quite productively. Where would you get the planes? Do you own them or do you lease them? How many do you have? We don't. We just signed a contract with a group in Bridgewater, Virginia called Dynamic Aviation to operate the aircraft for us. It's a, it's a similar model to how Delta would work with SkyWest or United with United Express. Go, go ahead. Yeah, we, we become that sales and service company. We handle your experience, every, everything about the interaction from the time you book the flight to getting on the plane to getting you off and where you're going is ours. Physically, the pilots and the aircraft themselves, those, those are run by Dynamic Aviation. And 2000 a month. Is there a major upfront cost, or can you do pay by the month? How do you do it? There's not. It's essentially month to month. There's a $500 initiation fee just so that we know you're real. Uh, and first flights will go up in September, so we're really excited.